actually guys, ano, nagtataka din ako bakit na uh, binago nila from the early rounds na I think uh, medyo may laban si Jerwin ng Kaas until the, the half of the uh, the fight na nakipagbakbaka na naman si Jerwin ng Kaas. Ito po, ano, ginagawa ko to, ito yung reaction ko at opinion ko dito sa laban ni Jerwin ng Kaas, Fernando Martinez. Medyo late ng konti pero tami nagtatanong sa akin eh, kung ano ba talaga ang, ang uh, pakiramdam ko dyan. Ito po yan. Powercast Sports. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Pao salute, Powercast Sports. Nagbibigay tayo ng opinion, reaction. At uh, syempre, minsan may analysis din tayo sa laban. First of all, gusto ko lang sabihin na I've always been a supporter of uh, Jerry ng Cajas. And uh, you know, I guess we found out on this fight that I think he really needs to move. Wow. two things that I will mention to you na medyo you know I'm I'm just wondering no hindi ko alam kung nag magta- nagtataka din kayo kung bakit ganito pero ito po yun ano so um early in the fight um Jerry Nangkas was jabbing he was moving around and in fact I think uh, that was a great plan no uh, ang ganda natatamaan niya and ex- as expected itong si Fernando Martinez na parang hindi tinatablan talaga ng kahit anong suntok ni Jerry Nangkas eh, su- sugod lang ng sugod no no uh, and uh, we expected that and uh, alam naman natin na ang gusto ni Fernando Martinez eh makipagbakbakan eh, yun yung gusto niya mangyari And ako yung nagtataka dahil after, you know, six round, eh, ayun na nga ang nangyari. Nakipagsabayan na nga si Jerry ng Kahas. At nakita na naman natin yung nangyari nung huling laban na talagang mas marami pong pinapatama itong si Fernando Martinez dito kay Jerry ng Kahas. Now, stop sugarcoating uh, that, you know, you know, it was the, you know, it was the, kumbaga, a good fight uh, for Jerry ng Kahas. It was a good fight. in general as a boxing fans kasi yun ang gusto nating makita and i'm sure the commentators everyone from from Argentina uh, eh talagang yan ang gusto makita ganyan yung laban but is it the kind of fight na dapat nilaban ni Jerry ng Kaas that's the question no and i'm sure uh, his team uh, realizes and recognizes that the first fight wasn't effective then if you do the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result i mean you know what i'm saying So, kaya ako nagulat. No, it's possible. You know, I would understand sa later round kasi natatalo na si Jerwin ng Casa scorecard. Actually, nakita niyo na nga yung scorecard. Ito, ipapakita ko sa inyo uli. Um, yan, ano? Na talagang halos walang binigay po uh, itong mga judges. Dal- dalawang rounds lang, no? Ang binigay. Yung isa, unang round. Yung isa, ito, uh, Jerwin ng Casa, halos 3 and 4 or 4 and 5. So early rounds, uh, Jeremy Nangkas was doing great until the moment na he start brawling. And I would understand if he brawl, magandang bandang 10, 11, 12 or 11, 12, uh, kung talagang dihado na siya. Kasi you have no choice. No, but uh, nakipag-brawl at nakipag-toe-toe uh, na siya after maybe around 6 yata yun eh. 6 if I remember correctly. I'm, I'm a bit surprised at that. At hindi na siya nag-jab masyado. He's using the power. He's trying to... to uh, unload uh, a knockout punch and if you're looking for a knockout punch you know that it's hard to uh, uh, it's hard to look at no i mean you you gotta start boxing and the knockout will come in nakita natin kung gaano katiba itong si uh, Fernando Martinez uh, sa laban so dun lang ako nagtataka i'm sure um it's either one or two things no it's either one or two things Uh, it's either they changed the strategy and they went toe to toe, or Jerry Nangkahas couldn't again uh, move that much. Uh, maybe because of stamina or condition. Uh, again, uh, the the main uh, concern that we had, di ba yung pinag-usapan natin lagi, is it too much already for Jerry Nangkahas to go down to one one five? Maybe he needs to move up to one two two or or uh, you know one one eight. So, you know, yun ang pinag-uusapan kasi he's been fighting and that uh, wait for a long time. And pag tumatanda tayo, lumalaki tayo, nahihirapan tayo, metabolism natin, hindi na ganun kabilis. So, that was the concern. So, I'm, I'm assuming, you know, that, uh, you know, um, kasi alam naman siguro, yung mga tao nga sa labas, alam nila na that Jerry needs to box. Why would he, why would he engage in a brawl? Uh, at uh, kailangan niya hindi magpa-corner why would he be in the corner diba sa sa ropes so 
So it's possible na nahirapan na rin siguro gumalaw kasi I mean it's very obvious that you need to use your jab and pay to go and all the rest of the ano para makaiwas sa brawl and uh, pitik-pitikan itong si Fernando Martinez. Nonetheless no, again it was a brave performance para dito kay Jerry ng Kahas. Um um maganda naman yung ano I, I think you know all of the Filipinos will still be proud of him pero sayang yung opportunity no. Um Uh, now it it begs me to question, you know, it, was it the right decision to maintain the hundred to one hundred fifteen, or you know maybe uh, sa one ano na lang no sa you know nagakat na lang ng timbang. Again, uh, yun ang ano ko. Kayo ano sa tingin you guys? Um, it's different kasi if your body couldn't respond to what you want to do. And you will be relegated to something na alam mong may advantage yung kalaban mo tas Ganon. So, anyway, it's good fight. Pinahirapan din naman niya si Fernando Martinez. Mancha-mancha rin naman yung mukha. Si, ano lang, ang kahas din, meron ganito. Um, good fight, but uh, eh, sa akin, ano, I think uh, the next fight, he should move up. You know, some some of the guys are saying he moves up to 122 right away. Skip 118. I mean, uh, Manny Pacquiao did skip uh, uh, some division. So, uh, depende siguro yan kung ano talaga saan mas condition. I think... Uh, Uh, uh that's what that's the the next step but at uh, congratulations Jeremy ng Kahas lumaban siya hindi siya nagpabaksak hindi siya nagpatalo he did his best and uh, I I'm I'm really I'm really still um uh kumbaga supportive pa rin ako sa kanya but let's be honest it, it wasn't the fight that uh, it wasn't the kind of strategy that we wanted to see with Jeremy ng Kahas uh because he did that already the last time what did you think